What we have today is piano lesson, introduction to piano. What is piano? Piano is a musical instrument with white and black keys, played by pressing the keys. We have different types of piano, grand piano, upright piano, electric piano, and so on. We have also acoustic piano. Each piano has distinctive sound depending on the materials it is made from. Early enough in the old era, piano is constructed by strings and that is why it was classified as string instruments. What is organ? Organ is also a musical instrument that is played by pressing the keys on it which has multiple pipes that produce sounds. What is then keyboard? A keyboard is a device or a musical instrument that consists of many instruments like piano, organ, harp, saxophone, and etc. What is the difference between piano, organ, and the keyboard? From antiquity, organ was seen to be the oldest because it was introduced far back as 3rd BC century before Christ and it was introduced by a man called Thesibius, a Greek living in Alexandria, Egypt during the 3rd BC century. They are constructed mainly with pipes. Then they were not using keys then. It was later introduced by using keys. What I mean by key? Keyboard. Piano is a musical instrument that was introduced by Bartholomew Christopher around 17 centuries. And it was played then in Padua in Italy. In 18th century to 19th century, a man called Elisha Gray introduced keyboard. He invented keyboard. But the first one he invented was musical or harmonic telegraph. It produces sound. So from there, all these digital keyboards we have started springing up. But initially, keyboard as we have it today, or organ as we have it today, they are used interchangeably. Somebody can say, I want to play a keyboard. I want to be an organist. I want to be a keyboardist. He is still referring to one thing. But the general name that is used now that comprises all of them is what we call keyboard. Not in the sense of that keyboard is piano. No. Piano has its distinct sounds. Organ has its own. Piano in the olden days has many sounds, like two or three or four. Uh, organ has its own peculiar sounds. Church organ, pipe organ, they have their own peculiar sounds. But in modern time, the, all the instruments like saxophone, all the instruments you can think of, are now modernized in digital organ as we have it today. And they are having all the sounds you may think of. Some may have 20 sounds, 50, 100, 200, 600, 1000 sounds. Musical instruments compressed in one keyboard. That's why we have digital keyboard now. What we have now reigning is digital keyboard. That doesn't mean you cannot see piano. Piano as it is or organ as it is in the olden days. You can still see it in some places. They are being modernized also. But remember that keyboard is the general name used now. But we still call it piano because it, it still has piano sounds, organ sounds. It still has many sounds in it. So keyboard is the newest name used. I want to be a keyboardist. I want to be. Because of the key being introduced, because of the keys being introduced. What I mean by keys, these things, because of this being introduced. Before, it was not like this. But now it is like this then we are calling them keyboards because there is board inside when you press this note any note you press 
it will touch the board which will signal the sound just like the typewriter we have keyboard typewriter we have there are input devices once you press the keyboard it will signal give sign to the the computer and whatever it gives the computer is what the computer will take if you press a b c d you will see it in your computer so keyboard now digital keyboard now is now input device so when you press it you signal the the sensors the ic's and the other things the components used in building them so that is how it is but initially key piano has its own peculiar sounds you build if you want to construct piano you construct piano if you want to construct organ you construct organ so if you want to build saxophone you you construct it but now all of them are now being gathered together into this keyboard digital keyboard we call it digital keyboard it is being powered by electric initially it was different so i don't want this video to be long just to introduce to you that we have different types of these keyboards so another one we enter into is what we call the piano applications remember we have piano we have organ and we have keyboard whether you call it piano or you call it organ you are still referring to the same thing in this modern era then if you see a keyboard like this one i'm using now first thing that will come to your mind is how do i put it on so that it makes sound first of all we have what we call adapter adapter or is a power source that reduces the high current into the current that this one needs so we have adapter we have this is where we have where we plug it in plug it and put it inside the keyboard at the back any at the side any place so if you see this sign just know that this is where you plug it uh, when you plug it on then another one is the button where you on it some have switch on and off some have standby on and off that is the thing some uses battery also you put the battery the dry cell battery or any battery is this it will start working another one you should know about this is this is that check the plurality some will have plus and minus inside plus inside minus outside but some will have minus outside and plus inside some will have plus outside and minus outside just know that casio casio keyboard normally have plus outside then minor in case you are using 12 volts battery well, if you want to know how to connect it you can connect it i normally use 12 volts battery to connect my own so know how to use them then another one you should know about is but first of all once you own your organ there, there is what we call default setting once you own your keyboard there is what we call default setting that default setting is once you own the organ there is a sound already partitioned for once you own the organ the sound will come once you own the organ the sound will come and you start pressing and this first sound you will see is what we call grand piano that is the first sound normally you will see in keyboard modern this digital keyboard once you own your organ you will see it then the second one is volume you know where to push the volume some we have this kind of switch or sliding volume you see it you can go up you go down but some we have knob something like movable knob like volume knob <laughs> so some we have that so if you know how to own it then another one you should know is this button you see this kind of button uh, that, that is where you change the sounds some we have screw where you screw up and screw down but some we have button some we have just the button that changes the sounds different keyboard 
have their different buttons so this is what you study as you go on but for now just on your organ there will be a default setting then you start playing then another function that is important for you as a beginner is what we call portal ground this portal ground is when you press something and you don't know, even know what you press again look for where they right portal ground once you press that portal ground the original setting will come back the on a, the default setting will come back but please as a beginner don't use any sound to practice use the that default sound which is called grand piano if it is not there just press 001 or 01 you see it that is the default setting use it because it has distinctive sound that will help you to understand what we are playing this is where we end today's lecture our next topic will be keys and functions of keys in keyboard these keys now how they are being arranged their names and how they function how they are being arranged that is the next topic i i will not be making this piano lesson much to have 10 minutes more than 10 minutes or more than 15 minutes i would like it to be short and simple so that you can follow it easily please subscribe follow my youtube subscribe to my youtube follow my facebook account also support if you have please also support there is need you support if you have because there are more we need to do so that people will understand what this degree is please don't forget to support don't forget to subscribe tell others about this channel thank you and god bless you